Hello guys, if you are struggling to generate leads for your business, then you are in good luck because in this video, I'm going to show you how you can generate leads for your business using Facebook ads. So the first thing that you want to do is to log in to your Facebook ad manager. So once you get here, just click on create. By the way, if this is the first time that you're joining me on this channel, ensure to like this video so that all the people can see it and follow me for more videos like this. So you want to go to leads right after clicking on campaign you go to leads and then you click on continue so facebook will give you two options the tailored ad campaign this is where facebook is going to guide you on how you can go about your campaign but in this one i'm just going to click on the manual setup because we want to run this campaign by ourselves so we click on continue so you see facebook ad is actually categorized into three stages we have the campaign okay we have the ad set and we have the ad so um, you want to name each of these so that you know what campaign you want to search for whenever you want to edit or optimize your campaign. So here I will call this, let's say, lead campaign. I will then put a date there. So I like to put like today's date, 23rd of um, May 2024. All right. So I can copy this as well so that I'll be using it in the different ad sets that I'll be making. So go down there, right? So this one categories, we have some special categories here, but the one that we are running is not belonging to any of these categories. We'll leave it the way it is. Then if you want to choose advantage campaign plus and all of that, you can choose that. But for now, we're just going to leave it as simple as it is. So go to next. So once you get here, this is where we have the ad set now. Okay. So I'm going to delete this new. And then I'll put this as the date as well. Okay. So now we have different conversion location. You can choose to run it on an Insta form um, that is usually collected on the Facebook platform themselves. All right. It's very fast and it converts a lot as well. But the one that we want to do is to run it on our website. So what you want to do next is to come here. Now you see here we have different um, performance goal right but the one we want is actually maximize number of conversions because we want as many people to come into our facebook um, i mean we want as many people to come into our funnel right so the pixel i want to use is of obviously is the uh, shola matthew pixel and then this one this is very important so instead of optimizing for purchase you want to optimize for leads because lead is what we want at the moment. Then you go on, continue here, right? This is where you now select your daily budget, okay? For this one, I'm just going to put in um, $5 for now. So I want to test run it for $5, and then eventually I will keep increasing the budget as it goes on. So here you can select a date that you want your advert to stop but for this particular advert we're going to leave it the way it is because i want it to continue if this ad start giving me good result i don't want to stop it so that's why i don't usually like to choose an end date and that you don't choose an end date doesn't mean that you can't stop your ad anytime so you can stop your ad anytime all right so the next thing you want to do is choose your location for this particular ad the location I want to choose is United Kingdom. So I'll leave it the way it is and then I'll go down, right? So we have more options actually. You can decide to choose the age that you want. So I'll just leave it the way it is. Now I leave this one as it is as well, Advantage Plus Audience because I want as many people to come into my funnel but I also want Facebook itself to use its AI or whatever technology they are using to help me find the audience that might be interested in my ad. So I can, after this one, I can create, you know, another ad set that I'm going to use to target another group of people. For example, I can target people that follow Russell Brunson or I can target people that follow Amy Porterfield. But for this particular ad, I'll just leave it the way it is. So once I'm done with that, you see, I'll click on next. And then here, I want to remove this new as well, put in the date that I had. So now, this ad is going to run both on my Facebook page and on my um, Instagram page. So I'll leave it the way it is. 
and then here you want to choose you know single image or video or you can choose carousel whichever one you want to use but the one i want to run at the moment is single image or video because i want to use a video now you can choose to use if you come here and then you can choose image or video so if you choose image you have to upload image and if you choose a video you have to upload video so i'm just going to click on add video all right so you can see i have a video here and i have a video some videos that i can use so one thing i love doing when it comes to facebook ad is i love to upload the video first on my page then go and pull it up from there but for this particular one the reason i love doing that is because you know it's more like a social proof many people tend to watch the video and then after they've watched the video um you know each comment each views that they have is going to be restored there so i can go quickly to my facebook page and then i will upload the video as quickly as possible so i am now on my facebook page right so i'll just come here i'll click on what's on your mind and then i click on video and then i click on this and then i go to this particular video so this is the video that i want to upload i'll click on open and then i'll leave it the way it is right so this one i they want me to change it to real so i'll just switch back all right so i don't want it to be a real i want it to be ordinary video now i've generated the facebook ad copy with my uh, with gemini now gemini is a product of google it's just like chat gbt that you can use to generate ad okay or you can use it to generate even copies or different things basically so what i did is that i went to gemini and i said gemini i copied everything on this page all right so i went to this particular page this is the landing page all right where people are going to go to to get this particular um video all right so i i copied everything on this page right they copy everything so once i copied it i came to gemini gemini is a product of google that it works just like G chat gbt where you can use it to create copies do a lot of things so i came here and i said gem i said generate a short facebook ad uh facebook policy compliant ad with this landing page copy for me and it generated this one okay so i'm gonna copy everything here right struggling right so i'm just gonna copy everything here and and then i'll go to my facebook and then i'll paste it there as well so um the, if you remember there is a headline there so i can also still use the headline so i'll use it so now it says free crash course so i can say um Two forty nine now free, right? So because I I want people to see the value of the course, okay? So I can say build, you know. So I can use that, and then this one I would like to put them, you know, to be on a different paragraph. So, so it's you know makes sense this way. Plus get a free thirty day game plan to skyrocket your leads with paid ads. Um, don't waste another minute get your free listing list building crash course now so i'm just gonna go to the landing page and i'll copy this um you know i'll paste the link here as simple as that about the facilitator shola matthew you know i can decide to just remove this stuff there so leave it the way it is for now because they're going to see it on the landing page anyway so i can copy all of this because i will use it on the ad as well so once it's done what i want to do is to click on posts all right let me see is that the price that i have 249 yeah so it's the same thing okay so i'll just say not now so um if i go to my page all right and i scroll up I should be able to see that video here but it's still being processed okay so the video would show um there all right so i'll come back to this particular facebook ad where i am running the ad so i'll go to add media add video and then i'll go to 
all videos and click there and then go to page videos right so you see this is the video that we just you know uploaded so i'll click on here and then i'll click on next so it says it's one to optimize the video like if you want to crop the video you can decide to crop it here but i'm not cropping it i'll just click leave it the way it is so here you know the video makes sense here it makes perfect sense the way it is here so i'm just gonna leave it the way it is but for this one facebook feeds and all of that i think it's better to make it here so i can come here and crop it and bring it down all right because i want it to show the whole of me here um, sometimes you can decide to leave it the way it is but let's see so this one i'll make it this way all right crop it normally you can create all of this differently okay but um this doesn't really make sense the way it is okay so that's why it is always preferable to use the recommended sizing and this one is for stories okay so um click on crop let's see what is gonna happen so confirm so let's play and see so i think this 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 makes sense the way it is for now so i'm just going to click on next all right um leave it the way it is make sure that this one is turned on oh, optimization and then click on done so what i'm gonna do right is that uh, you can leave this you can just cancel this as well so what you want to do is i'm gonna you know what we copied earlier so come here paste it there so the text this is the primary text is going to be here that's what people are going to see all right so copy this particular link all right and then scroll down so you're going to put it here you know where it says headline okay this is where you're going to put it website url okay so if you scroll up you're going to see the way it's going to be grow your list by at least 1000 so now instead of this grow your list this one seems long so you want to you know come here and where it says headline right so this is where you want to choose the headline so you can say um, maybe get the video for free or start building your list for free okay so I said get the course for free today um, where is it again so I said get the course for free today can you see it so that seems to make sense more so I would screw up and then here it says instant form what you want to do is to remove it from instant form because we don't want it there for now so just because we want people to go to our website so I'm just gonna put it as known so once you're done with that just go ahead and publish your ad so once your ad is published facebook is going to look into your ad and then um facebook would you know send you an email or they can send you a notification on the app manager right where they will tell you that the ad has been approved and if the ad is rejected they will tell you why it's rejected so that you can work on it i hope you learned something today so with this particular one now many people will come to this page because this ad is will be sending them to this page so many of them will come to this page and if they like what they see okay so there's gonna they're gonna click on yes i want and then they'll put their details yes and then it will take them to the training which they are gonna get for free and as they register for free as well they're going to get this particular you know 30 day game plan to 1000 engage subscriber would pay us for free absolutely free so if you're also watching this video and you want it i'm going to leave a link in the description where you can follow through you can also get this training for free uh yeah so thank you so much for watching and please remember to like this video so that other people can see it and subscribe to my youtube channel okay so that you get notifications whenever i post videos like this i look forward to seeing you on the other side bye